The program brought together Muslims and Christians, as well as professionals from different backgrounds, who rendered diverse opinions on how to achieve a Nigeria free of religious intolerance. For the project coordinator, Hajia Halimat Oyedele, Nigeria has suffered series of religious extremism and tensions, which needed to abate for progress. The basic um, aim of this program is to promote interreligious harmony. This issue of um, you must be a Christian, you must be a Muslim, you must come to my fold, we don't want it. Islam is all about tolerance, it's not, Islam is all about accommodating, and Islam is all about acceptability. The country is divided along so many fault lines, ethnicity, religion. Religion is a source of conflict, not only in Nigeria, but all over the world. Guest speaker and a lawyer, Nuruddin Asunigi, says the constitution provides for freedom of religion and that no religion is superior to the other. We all are children of Adam, regardless of the faith we say we profess. What force is important is how to protect our humanity. A two-man panelist made up of a Muslim and a pastor was set up to throw more light on the issue. Tenet 8 talks about freedom of thought, conscience and religion, including freedom to change your religion and belief. Yes, religion control a lot. But the individuals are accountable for their decisions and actions. Goodwill messages flowed freely. They for God so love the world. They didn't say for God so love the Christians or the Muslims. There is something which you understand that uh, God Almighty, the Almighty Allah, did not create human beings to belong to one religion. There was question and answer time to illuminate gray areas and the participants sure had some meaningful takeaways. In Benin, Rosemary Omani, NTA News.